All right, my friends and lovers of clay, today we get to start our additive textures. Now a texture is something that it, you can feel. It's a repeating pattern that is tactile, that you can feel it. So I can feel the rough edge of this. It's got some texture. So if I were to add just one of something onto my pinch pot, that does not count. It's not repeating. I can feel it, but it doesn't repeat, all right? So I wanna see multiples and pretty dramatic. And again, additive, meaning we are adding clay. So you could roll out little teeny tiny spikes. And I suggest doing maybe five of something at a time, because if you, if you make too many, then they're gonna dry out too fast before you can get them all attached. Um, there's a million different possibilities for the kinds of textures that you can make. I've gone ahead and just made these a little petal-like feels for myself. Now, it's very tempting to take one of these and just stick it onto the clay and say, yeah, bueno, it's done, but it's not. As clay shrinks, excuse me, as clay dries, it shrinks, and so this is going to pull away from it and not actually stick. So we've got to do some things. I like to score, slip, score. Some people just slip and score. I score it. Then I'm gonna take my slip, my ooey gooey slip, slime it up, and then you have to score again. And do the same thing for the little piece that you are adding to your clay. Now, that is stuck. So I can do a great big area kind of all at once. And again, if I pre-make a bunch of these, then it moves a little faster, but I don't want to make so many that they're drying out before I can get them on the pot. So go for it. I want big, bold, tactile, really popping out of your pot, completely changing the surface from smooth to totally awesome. Okay, whole thing, cover it up, go for it. 